Okay, so here we are in the garden now. And people will tell you, you have to provide perfect growing for gardens. Every weed's got to be removed, the soil's got to be perfect. Well, I'm here to tell you that's not really true. What you need is a nice soil. And you can see what I've got here. It's just a mixture of cardboard, old compost, a little bit of seaweed, a bit of old plant matter, anything I could get over the last year. As you might remember that this was actually just a lawn. And we cardboarded it over, sections of cardboard, and we just put all of the compost on top of it. A bit of old horse dung, in fact, anything we could find to put on it. Now that in the background, that's my greenhouse, which I'm getting to cast away from a friend of mine. And it's going right behind me. So when the flowers are finished on here and the bees have got no more use for them, we'll pop a greenhouse on there and that'll look fantastic. But today, it's onions. And these are onion sets. What that is, it's an onion seed that's allowed to grow to a certain length and then it's stopped. And then that becomes perfect for planting on the next year. Now, as I've mentioned, the soil itself just needs to be reasonably dry. In fact, looking in here, you can see bits of the old mulch. It's the old cardboard. Bits of old seaweed down here as well. And all we do is loosen it up a little bit. And then a nice straight row. Put them in. Now, normally you'd put these in about six or eight inches apart. But, as I've got a lot of bulbs, I'm putting them in three inches apart. Then when they get to a reasonable size, I'll thin them out. And I can either use the little ones as pickled onions, or better still, I can just shred them up and put them in a nice stir fry. It'll be absolutely lovely. And you see, onions, it's as easy as that. Make sure they're clean, they're dry, there's no tails on the top or the bottom. Put them in, push them down into the soil. As you can see, not too difficult, nice and easy. In it goes. Markers bunch of stones. That lets me see exactly where that row is. Now around here the birds will pull them out. So I'll just lightly cover them over and that will protect them until the birds have gone. Onions, job done. <laughs>